back to our channel. Today we are going to discuss life cycle of plasmodium in mosquitoes, also called as Ross cycle. So in Ross cycle, generally we observe so gametocytes are formed in the human beings who are infected. Those gametocytes are transferred to the mosquito through the bite, a sucking of the blood. So suck inoculation during the blood, automatically gametocytes along with some erythrocytic joint, erythrocytic stages entered into the mosquito. Later they transformed into crop. So crop lo, uh, transferred into the crop. Let uh, crop lo uh, development and then choose. So crop e dey thundu crop lo manu fertilization observe cheech. Ila onna tuvante e particular cycle e dey thundu. We are starting with the gametogeny. Then later uh, fertilization, formation of vermicule or vaginite, also called as sporogeny. Four stages ka manu plasmodium vivax mosquito life cycle chepto. Aithe. Gametogony is nothing but formation of gametes, both male gamete and female gamete. So formation of male gamete, formation of female gamete and we choose. Throughout the how the fertilization occur, fertilization type and we choose. So first and foremost, we have micro gametocyte in male gamete. In male gamete, we have a nuclei, one eight daughter nuclei divided. So eight daughter nuclei cause the, they trans, eight daughter nuclei, cytoplasm and the, they formation, uh, form a, flagella like structures so these daughter nuclei enter into the every flagella so ila unnatundi flagella laaga convertition anedi manam chodochu from this flagella stage one flagella are also called as male gamete detached so that phase is called as x flagellation so x flagellation edaithundi ee particular phase varaku manam formation of male gamete ga cheptundi so chudandi eight daughter nuclei then flagella like structures one is detached from this stage so that is called as x flagellation then female gametocyte. So there is a one large also called as macro gametocyte. Macro gametocyte uh, developed and mature. So maturation phase throughout the, it forms a fertilization cone. So that fertilization cone contains cytoplasm and nuclein. So we flagellated or micro gamete is mixed with the macro gamete. So male and female gametes fusion either that is called as fertilization. So both are dissimilar in size. That's why it is anisogamy type. So the fusion of male and female gametes form a syncarion. Syncarion means both the nuclei, pronucleus are mixed. So syncarion stage is occurred. So syncarion also called as an uh, anisogamic type of fertilization because it is similar size of gametes. Later it turns into the zygote. Zygote is round and at the same time non-motile. After some time zygote will transform into worm-like structure that is called as vermicule which is long, slender and motile. So vermicule also called as euchnite. So this euchnite pieces the wall of the crop, then it turn, it entered into the next region. So this euchnite turn into oocyst by formation of cyst wall. So there is a cyst around the body, that's why it is called as oocyst. This nuclei will undergo number of reduction divisions and repeated mitotic divisions form a number of nuclei. So this nuclei then transformed into sporoblasts. Spore-like structures, that's why it is called as sporoplasts. The formation of sporozoids is called as sporogony. So sporogony is in this particular area. Sporozoids form a twin stage in sporocyst. So oocyst turns into the sporocyst. So this sporocyst contains number of sporozoids. They are developing, developing, developing. So once sporozoids, a number is more, automatically they rupture the sporocyst wall. So ruptured sporozoids or ruptured sporocyst liberates number of sporozoids which are infective stages. These sporozoids enter into the hemocyl of the mosquito. So then later they transform into cellular glands. So when the mosquito bites human beings automatically the sporozoids enter into the human beings. So that is the infective stage of plasmodium vivax. So here we can see development of gametes that's why it is called as gametogony. Here we can see development of spores, that's why it is called as sporogony. These two are the main phases of the plasmodium vivax mosquito cycle. So, this particular area is the same as the hemocyclium cellular glands. So, we can say four stages. So, one is uh, gametogony, formation of gametes, fertilization, formation of zygote, then vermicule formation, then sporocyst. So, sporocyst formation is the same the number of divisions are in throughout the day and tend to the normal salivary glands. I think the development of oocyst is in the oocyst to the sporoblast or the tonki so 18 to 24 hours per day. The complete life cycle component tonki 10 to 24 days per day. 
సో ఎయిట్ డేస్ పట్టినటువంటి ఈ టైంలో ఈ మొత్తం డెవలప్ అయ్యి రెడీగా ఉంటాయి స్పోరోజైమ్స్ విచ్ ఆర్ ఇన్ఫెక్టివ్ స్టేజెస్ సో అలా ఉన్న క్లాస్మోడియంని ఇలా కూడా చెప్తున్నాను గ్యామిటోగని ఫర్టిలైజేషన్ ఫార్మేషన్ ఆఫ్ వర్మిక్కుల్ అర్గుకినెట్ స్పోరో గడియన్ సో ఈ ఫేజెస్ రెడీగా ఉన్నాయి నో దే ఆర్ ఇన్ఫెక్టివ్ స్టేజెస్ వన్స్ దే బైట్ ద హ్యూమన్ బీయింగ్స్ దెన్ లెటర్ హ్యూమన్ సైకిల్ ఈ స్టార్టెడ్ లైక్ హెపాటిక్ సైజ్లో కానీ ఎరిత్రోసైటిక్ సైజ్లో కానీ ఎగ్జో ఎరిత్రోసైటిక్ సైజ్లో కానీ స్టేజెస్ అనేవి మళ్ళీ రిపీటెడ్గా జరుగుతుంది సో ఇది లైఫ్ సైకిల్ ఆఫ్ క్లాస్ మూడ్ ఇన్ మస్ట్ థ్యాంక్ ఫర్ వాచింగ్